Storm Team 4 weather center. I'm meteorologist Ryan Miller. We've got clouds around right now, but just give it a little bit of time. Sunshine's coming back into the sky this afternoon. Low humidity values. We're going to have temperatures that are below average. We're talking 79. Beautiful weather for outdoor activities. Go get a picnic. Now, uh, heading into the day tomorrow, we're going to get warmer back into the lower 80s. And no appreciable rainfall coming our way here for the upcoming week. All right, Ryan. Thank you very much. A reminder, you can get the latest news and weather anytime with the NBC Washington app. Now back to the Today Show. together. 
together a five-year business plan of what could happen if they let me audition for this movie. And if I audition for the movie, then I'll meet people who could introduce me to casting directors or agents, and then I could get into short films and commercials, and then I could take me to pilot season. Like, I looked into everything. And my parents realized that I was very serious about this. So serious that they agreed to drive their ambitious young daughter some 20 hours round trip to Los Angeles for every audition. So what were those early years like? It was hard because you go to from a small town to a big city and there's a hundred thousand people who want the exact same thing. Right. And my five year business plan wasn't five years, it took ten. It was a lot of notes. And as a preteen and to a teenage girl being told no all the time, it was really hard. Her perseverance paid off. In 2018, Sweeney was cast in three successful shows. Everything Sucks, Sharp Objects, and The Handmaid's Tale. You just got me cheating on you. You should care. Sweeney's quick rise has thrust the young actress into the spotlight and the headlines. To have your face so recognizable and your name and you've become this sort of iconic person <laughs> you have into mean, teenage girls and, and others. Have you grappled with that yet, that you are this figure in the culture? I definitely feel the responsibility of it. I'm still figuring it all out. It's complicated. Yeah. I'm still a 25 year old girl trying to figure out life. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. In her latest film, Reality. Sweeney takes on another 25-year-old, real-life NSA contractor, reality winner, who was arrested and convicted of leaking classified intelligence in 2018. Reality, just, just an amazing performance by you, especially when you consider that this is a film based verbatim on an FBI transcript. There's no dramatization, you didn't flower it up or do anything different. So when you heard the idea for this, did you say, how are we going to pull that off exactly? I I was a little scared because I've never done something where I had to take someone's dialogue verbatim and make sure that I was honoring it. I really wanted to make sure that I was doing justice to reality story. It was too much to sit back and watch it and think, why do I have this job if I'm going to be helpless? What did you sympathize with when you read her story? I just saw this, this girl that is coming of age, trying to navigate life, that thought she was doing the right thing for the people that she served. This sounds really bad. Am I going to jail tonight? Congratulations on reality. Thank you. Really good. People are going to love seeing it. And mostly congratulations on your 69 rock up. Thank you. The crime jewel. <laughs>
see you tomorrow. We love you. We'll see you here on the Family Field. Show until next time. This is Peter Tomarkin on behalf of the Focati Rug saying thanks for pressing your luck. Bye bye. So anyway, we have just 10 seconds to say goodbye. We'll see you uh, tomorrow. So long. Bye bye. Yeah. We got we, five seconds. Oh no, we have three, two, one. Bye. bye. bye.